Now here is how you can create a habit tracker or use Notion for habit tracking. When, you come, when it comes to this, you essentially have two options. Before we get started, make sure you are subscribed to this channel so you never miss videos like these. Essentially, the first option is to keep things simple and essentially just start a new page, you know, type in the title and just keep it to yourself, like click on the, the plus, nothing crazy, you can just add a simple table right here where, you know, just type in like running as an example and you can just go and like, uh, you know, just create a table of like dates, you know, perhaps you, you just use it for a week, for a month, you can say, just type in like Monday and now you can just use a green uh, check mark like this and you can mark it like, that way. This is a very simple approach and I guess it kind of works in a lot of situations, but you know, you could make it much more fancy if you really wanted to, which is obviously the second option. And if you want to make it a little bit more professional, what you can do is to start a new page in your Notion and you can click on choose template. And when you go in here, you can see we have a couple of options. One of them is literally habit tracker. And you essentially can just bring this template into your Notion. And using this, you have like fancy stuff like buttons. When you just type in that you clicked, that you clicked that you ran today or, you know, I uh, got eight hours of sleep, of journal, whatever it might be. And at the bottom, you will have like a page of everything uh, being marked in there based on the dates. Obviously, it's just a, you know, I already have it right here. Obviously, it is much more professional and you can just set it up. You can see that you can click that you ran today. Now it's going to be managed right here or that you got eight hours. It's going to be added as a check in here. This is like the official featured template for habit tracking on Notion. Of course, you can customize it, switch it to anything else. And yeah, you can do stuff like this. However, this is still not the only option as there are also plenty of other habit tracking options on a Notion template website. So when you go ahead and look up Notion Habit Tracker template, there is gonna be the Notion store, which you can get into and get some different templates, which most of them are free. Some of them are paid, but you can see 1500 templates for you to pick. So you can see so many different options, even with graphs and whatever. So you can definitely browse, browse them right here, see what it kind of looks like. You can get the template and bring it over into your Notion page pretty easily. So that's a very practical option. I'm going to wrap up the video right now. Make sure to hit the thumbs up, subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.